Here's the view from the front range on Tuesday evening in a video time lapse. That's Jupiter and Saturn in what's called a conjunction. That's when two objects in our sky move close to each other. And since Jupiter and Saturn are our solar system's biggest planets, it's called a great conjunction. And if you're out looking now, kind of watching that progress, you'll see these two objects get closer and closer and closer together. Astronomer Naomi Poiquet with the Denver Museum of Nature and Science says that these two planets align like this only once every 20 years. But this time, they'll come so close that they'll eventually appear as one single object in the sky. That moment will happen on December 21st, the winter solstice, and you're not going to want to miss it. They haven't been seen that close in nearly 800 years. All you need is your eyes. Look to the west just after sunset, then turn to the southwest and look up. You can practice finding the Great Conjunction every evening until the planets are at their closest on Monday. Another thing that makes this conjunction unusual is the timing on the week of Christmas. Some are even calling it the Christmas star or the star of Bethlehem as referenced in scripture. Poiquet says Saturn and Jupiter were not close to each other during that historic time, but there were other conjunctions that could be seen. Jupiter with a star Regulus, which is the brightest star in the constellation Leo, and Jupiter and Venus, which is even brighter than Jupiter, would have been a very close conjunction both in uh, June and August of 2 and 3 BC, and that possibly could have explained that phenomenon. Meteorologist Corey Reppenhagen, 9 News.